Piggity piggity bongs. I bid you welcome. Welcome, I my fellow gamers, to the very first Lost. episode of Layers of Fear. Alone. Hopeless. And you we are kicking this it. off probably the first but of October. You, so, I'd like to say happy way. October to everybody. A way to bring it all back. Finish it. Finish it. The one Say precious it. thing you ever truly Say desire. It. Finish it. Finish it. Yes. <laughs> yes, I have played this before, but it was a while ago. I don't remember it too well. So, I thought it time to revisit this masterful game because the one thing I do remember about this game is I absolutely loved the ambience or ambience, whatever ambiance of this game it was freaking amazing oh it's okay I remember the controls now and most of the story in here is told through clippings and I'm probably not gonna read them <laughs> not gonna lie however I will leave them up on screen for you guys to read if you wish Sorry if there was a little jump there, I was just adjusting the microphone. So if there was a little jump, I probably cut it out because it was noisy. Yeah, I'm I'm not too I'm not really strong of a reader, so I'm not gonna try to read this stuff. I mean I'll read it to myself, but I'm not gonna read it out loud because I don't feel like making a bunch of mistakes in this game. I love the music though. It's so fucking beautiful. Oh, hello. What do we have here? Ah, a photo. Actually, a lot of times I've played it, I don't think I've ever found that photo before. That's oh, right, it's telling us where the key is. Key to our paint room is in the office. Upstairs. Not down here, but we're gonna look around down here just for the hell of it. Oh, well, that doesn't work. Huh. The water was on. How about that? Too bad we really can't see in there. I'm hoping this isn't too dark. It doesn't look like it's too dark on the TV. And my TV's not really... The brightness isn't really turned up on it. So it should be okay. I'm hoping anyway. I really am. There it goes. <laughs> Fuck with the piano too much. Bad things happen. <laughs> You've learned that from just about every game there is. And working all night, don't wake me up. Hello. Tumbling all around, tumbling all around, tumbling all around. It's so funny. Alright, I forgot about that. <laughs> I'm all forget about a lot of stuff in here. I stepped right on my toes and when she Okay, it's not the cell. <laughs> Sorry I couldn't sleep. The leg's been acting up again. Figure you might as well. Might as well do some work. Love you. So I'm going to assume that's a message to our wife. Because if I remember right, our character has a wooden prosthetic leg. That's locked. So we will not be going in there. We will be going over here. Okay. Loud, loud bang. That's always a good sign, right? That means come this way. It's inviting. Uh, let's see what this says. Uh, da -da -da. Oh, 
Oh, uh, this guy is very upset because of the way that our character here has done some drawings for Red Riding Hood. Well, let's have a look at these, shall we? So, not too bad, right? Still not too bad. That's a little dark. <laughs> Still a little dark. And then, dark. <laughs> okay, we need this key. That's what we came up here for. We came up for the key. The key is what we need. Not this way, that's not downstairs. We must make it to our little workshop to finish it. Accidentally closed it. I wanted to open it. Lots of, uh, lots of bottles. And paintbrushes. Lots of bottles and paintbrushes. Spooky. It's covered for a reason. We can't open any of these, then we'll open as we collect the things we need to do the painting. Oh. Get it right this time. I really wish that this game was in VR. This seems like it would be absolutely fucking terrifying in VR. Not that it's not a spooky game, because it is. And I would strongly suggest picking this game up if this is the first time you're seeing it and you really enjoy horror games and you kind of want to experience it for yourself fuck you you kind of want to experience it for yourself I didn't get to read that stupid window it's it's not very expensive it is kind of short maybe about four four and a half hours probably less it can be done in about two if you're you know not really exploring and just kind of run through it Okay, we'll, we'll probably go with two hours. The average person will finish in about two, two and a half hours. If you are... Oh, scraps of love. Going in circles. Oh, we haven't gone in a circle yet, but... I'm sure we'll get there. But for such a short experience, it is... A nice game. It's a good game. Oh, that is fucking spooky, the wind there. It does eerie so well. It's subtle. In some in some places. Like I said, the ambience or ambiance. I'm just gonna say ambiance, even though it's probably ambience. Or ambient. I'm here with ambiance, okay? Just the way I pronounce things. Anyway, this is a request for the wedding. But it does it so well. That? What, what? What is that again? I forget what that is. Oh, it must have to do with that. Okay. So we gotta find the combo. There we go. Eight, five, four. So. Eight. Five. Four. I remember this puzzle only because it took me forever to fucking find how to do it. The past holds back. Look closer. The thought okay. alone that the most beautiful piece of art doesn't have my name on it is killing me. So, will you marry me? It's corny, but at the same time, I think that's a wonderful pickup line. Well, you know, a proposal line, not pickup. I think that's a really good line. Oh! Hello. Never forget. Never forget to check this stuff out. Look around. Holy shit. <laughs> I think there's a bug in here because something just flew against me and it fucking spooked me, <laughs> motherfucker. Uh, 
Nerves are a little, uh, you know, a little on edge when playing any type of horror game. Even if you've played it before, you'll still find that your nerves are a little on edge. A masterful horror game will make your nerves be on edge regardless how many times you play it. Unless you play it, like, over and over and over again, one playthrough after another. But it has been so long for me that I really don't remember. Uh, uh, stuff like that. <laughs> I was going to compliment on the fucking doll baby thing that was just, I'm guessing, nailed there. To the portrait. But I didn't get a chance to. Wow, this is really... What's this? Oh, let's say this is really dark. I know it's supposed to be a dark game, but at the same time, I mean, we want to be able to kind of see a little bit here. Right, let's let's try that. Okay, we're we're hardly able to see. anything unless we get really really close to it why is that? I feel like there's a light switch it's probably a light switch there is motherfucker fuck off <laughs> whoa this game is really good at that by the way things appearing behind you it loves doing that I thought there was something else down here. I guess not. That's why I was looking for the light switch. I really thought there was a uh, a rat collectible. And when we find our first rat collectible, which I don't know when it will be, y you'll see what I'm talking about. Because I have yet to collect all the rat collectible things in this game. And you may have noticed this is under a different PSN, and that's because I am playing on my alternate account. Spin the world! Remember this used to be a fun game. You'd spin the globe and then try to stop it with your finger. It's, it's stupid, I know. you try to stop it with your finger, and wherever it lands is where you would say that you were going to go for a vacation or something like that. I've seen it in a couple movies, older movies, like... That's how rich people fucking decided shit. It's stupid and really cliche, but... When I was younger, it didn't take... Well, it still doesn't take much to entertain me. What the f... Oh, yeah. That's great. I was gonna ask if that's blood, but it'd make more sense that it's paint, actually. Yeah, that's... That's cool. That's good looking. There's the music. Ah, oh, the music in this game is so fucking good. The, just the noise. The noise alone is so fucking good. Paint Deep Lies. Now, a tiny bit to the left. Yes, just like that. Hold that pose. I want to get all those lovely curves just right. <laughs> Oh, you do a little laugh, too. I'm not the only one who does a little laugh. Oh, we can turn it. I'm not that round? What, what, what are you talking about? I don't think you made her look plump, really, in any areas. Uh, legs maybe a little, little big, as, you know... I don't know. What do I know? I'm not an artist, so... But I'm not that round doesn't really make sense to me because round to me is another word for like being plump. And I, I, I use plump over, you know, fat. I'm a bigger guy. So. And we're, we're at the rat genocide part of this. <laughs> what the f okay. okay. Uh, yeah, I, I use... I'm not seeing it, but it seems like more rats are running into the fire. I don't really care for the word fat. 
for plump. Or happy. And big is also okay. Oh, the fire is out. Jesus Christ! How the fuck did I not remember that? Fuck off. Yeah, the, uh, the jump scares in the game are... They're there. And if it wasn't such a good game, I would hate it for its use of jump scares. Because I'm not a huge fan of jump scares. But this game really does it well. So I don't mind it. Uh, that is a weird outside. Then again, this entire house makes no sense whatsoever. So, I mean, that's just weird room, weird locations, stuff like that. Part of the course. Oh, sorry, this is no explaining that. Um, well, it seems that our wife was uh, kind of suffering from some post birth depression and stuff like that. I don't really know the proper term for it. Uh, I hate crying. Hello? Okay. I'm, I'm sorry. Hello? It's about time for us to talk, don't you think? I mean, I've seen you in my house so many times, and yet I could never find the courage to face you directly. Not until now. Okay, the cr Oh, damn it. I was gonna say the crying stopped. Let's just, let's just leave. Ah, uh, which way? It doesn't really matter. I guess this way. Okay, let's check the other way. Okay, that is locked. So, we have but one course ahead of us. Which is through here. Hello? Anybody home? So many broken bottles everywhere. It's really easy to tell that we have a drinking problem. And it's pretty serious. Garlic. I really want to learn to cook with garlic. First step is the hardest. Well, with any addiction. I mean, it definitely is. Ooh, I got bright. And it's getting brighter. Alright, so I, I guess we won't be going that way. Is this... Are we supposed to stare at this? No? W what are we missing here? Hmm. What? Oh! Okay, now, now it's just happening as we look around. Hello? Motherfucker. We're not going out that way. Now we're supposed to look at this. There it goes. has completely turned into something First, else. I looked for a canvas. Not just any canvas. No, that would be I had too. to find a knife. Not one of those bread ones. It needed to be as sharp as a razor. So I used a razor, in fact, and then carefully flayed the skin. Booze helped keep my hands steady. Now I'm wondering, did 
is it a skin from his wife or his own skin? Maybe that's what happened to his leg. Regardless, we have gotten the first piece to our masterpiece. Looks like a couple of flamingos. Looks good. I said we stop there. That's perfect, right? We don't need to paint anymore. We painted creepy flamingos. <laughs> and as you can see, now one of the uh, doors is open. And in the back there, you can kind of read what he said first. I looked for a canvas, not just any canvas, yada, yada, yada. But I do believe that I'm going to end this episode here. Hate, even now, look. Oh, lost, not look. Lost. You deserve it. Finish it. But yeah, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, be sure to hit that like button for me. If you're not subscribed, subscribe for more. Maybe share this or another video around. If you did, I would greatly appreciate it. Take care, my fellow gamers, and I'll see all of you in the next video.